Right now, Governor DeWine says 90% of our state's economy is reopened with the state allowing stores to welcome back guests the last week. But some businesses are remaining closed. News 5 Jesse Schultz takes us to Stark County, where one store is taking the reopening process slow for safety. Inside this 40,000 square foot warehouse in Canton, you'll find thousands of pieces of antique furniture that have withstood the test of time. Main Street Modern, we believe, is the largest mid-century furniture store in the country. Adam Hoover owns Main Street Modern. We definitely have something for everyone. We have people come from all over the world. And now Hoover is testing time too. Despite giving the green light to open up this warehouse to the public, he says he's going to wait a bit to see if cases spike. We just wanted to give it a little bit more time and see what actually happens before we uh, fully open up. Main Street Modern closes every winter so and Hoover and his team can restock the warehouse. This is a crossover between Art Deco and Mid-Century. And every April they have a grand reopening. The parking lot fills up, the road fills up, and we have a lot of people that come from all over the United States. Typically getting a big portion of their yearly sales from that day alone. Unfortunately this year we weren't able to do that. But despite losing out, he's not rushing to get the crowds back in. On Saturday, Hoover will start Start to reopen. We're going to only take one appointment at a time, which really only leaves us with like nine appointments a day. Uh, so not a lot of people are going to get in, but hopefully the people that really need it will be the people that schedule it. Accepting that like the inventory in a store, 2020 will be a snapshot of history. We're going to do whatever uh, we feel is the safest for us and all of our customers. Reporting in Canton, Jesse Schultz, News 5.